Today on The Woodworks, we are gonna do a watermelon feta salad. Turn off the Food Network and let me show you how the wood works. All right, I'm gonna start incorporating salads for you guys because I think it's always an health, a healthy option. The one thing with salads where people get into trouble is they don't realize how much fat is in salad dressings. So I like to make my own at home, which is very simple. The dressing for this is like the olive oil, the white balsamic vinegar, and that's kind of it. That's kind of and a little salt. Let me run down the list of ingredients. Three tablespoons of olive oil, two teaspoons of white balsamic vinegar, uh, half a teaspoon kosher salt. You might need more of those three things. Um, you'll have to see how it goes. Eight ounces of grape tomatoes, halved. Three cups arugula, one cup sliced red onion, two tablespoons chopped basil, two pounds of watermelon cubed, four ounces of feta cheese, and one chopped and seeded jalapeno. So you just wanna take balsamic, the olive oil, and if I need more, I left the stuff out here on the side, and a little bit of salt, and just whisk it together. Then it's very simple in my bigger bowl here, we're just gonna combine everything. So take your watermelon. Let's take the jalapenos, cause I don't know if I wanna use it all. Um, take some of the onion. We'll do the feta last. We're gonna use all the tomatoes for sure. I'm gonna add some of the arugula, a little of the basil. Okay, so now I got everything in here except the dressing and I'm just gonna um, mix it up a little bit to see how it looks. I know how I want this to look for sure. And um, arugula is really great to go along with the, the watermelon because it has a little peppery flavor. So that kind of balances with the sweetness of the watermelon. I mean, and as you can see, it already looks fantastic and I haven't even put the dressing on, there's no feta on. I'm gonna add some more of the basil and I think I'm gonna definitely use all the jalapeno and all the onion. Some more arugula. And then I mix that up again. And I like to use a spoon when I have a watermelon salad like this cause I don't wanna use the tongs. I might use that to serve it, but this is a little easier to get everything mixed. I mean, this looks great. I'm gonna add some of the salt and now I'm gonna add the salad dressing that I made, which was just olive oil and white balsamic. This, I mean, look at that. That's, you can't tell me that doesn't look fantastic. Just look at it. Come on, Chance. It looks beautiful. Yeah? Let me, um, Want to get a little bit of everything. I think I got everything right there. Oh boy. It is so good. So fresh and light. Okay, I need a little onion. I think I got a little jalapeno. Okay. Check that out. It's the perfect watermelon salad bite. I'm gonna add the rest of the basil, because I love basil, and basil goes fantastic with watermelon. I don't think people realize that, but basil goes great with watermelon. Okay, I'm gonna, just gonna plate this up and put a little feta over the top and we'll give it another taste. Okay, watermelon feta salad. I'm gonna try to get everything in one bite here. There we go. Mm. 
It's so good. You get the pepperiness from the arugula. Then you get a little bite of the jalapeno. The tomatoes. The onion. The feta. But obviously the star of this is the watermelon. This is definitely like my top three salads that I like of all time. It's amazing. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm -mm. A little bit of salt just kind of sets everything off. This is amazing. Try it at home. It's a good way to maybe get your kids into salad because it's watermelon. So maybe, I don't know. Would you have eaten this when you were little, Chance? Probably. We just eat a lot of salads growing up. Mm hmm. It's so good. Try it at home. I'm out. Mmm. You might as well do it every time, yeah. <laughs> you know, tradition now. <laughs>